Obviously, I lost a stupid bet. Why would I? Why? Why did I change my class when I definitely did not need to do this? This is not not what I wanted to do. Uh. All right. Well, everyone keeps asking me, so I figured I would go ahead and let's talk about this Crusader. Uh, you guys all know. I'm sure you guys all saw the video where I lost a bet. And unfortunately, that put me in a situation that I'm in currently where you see me playing as a crusader instead of my my deep down bones of a demon hunter. Um, I missed my class. I'm not total total disclosure. I miss playing demon hunter. I thought that class was so much fun and really played with my play style uh, more so than anything else because it was nice and fluent. Uh, I've been playing the crusader here for a while and uh, you know what? It's um it's been okay it hasn't been it hasn't been the worst it hasn't necessarily been the best and um moving forward though i think it's gonna be all right I, i've been trying to play with it and, and kind of keep an open mind so i want to talk about a few things and one of those is going to be kind of gear so we all know that gear really makes the mastermind like it makes the biggest difference when it comes to everything right uh, when we see, talk about gear we talk about like what legendary items do you have unfortunately i did not get lucky and i have not gotten a whole lot of these legendary pieces and actually let's go ahead and let's just go over to this uh this essence transfer area and i've talked to people like um mad capper who's a fellow content creator good friend of mine i've talked to people like a veiled shot uh obviously you guys are probably well aware of who veiled is if you're aware of who i am and uh you know they're they're, they're kind of the lead crusaders that i, I kind of lean on for these builds and ideas and i've watched other content creators videos now there's a few things that i think is going to make a big difference because i do think um i really honestly i have to get the stupid arrow keeper i think if i don't get this the crusader is never going to be fun for me mainly because the one thing i was excited about when switching to a crusader was the fact that i would get to change and just try a whole new skill one is right because i did no research on the crusader the demon hunter i knew before launch of diablo immortal that i was going to main it and i was did all the research that i possibly could i knew down to the t exactly what skills i wanted to use how the gameplay was going to shake out for me and I, w I predicted it all correctly. Uh, if you guys will watch my old, old video on Diablo Immortal where I talk about the Demon Hunter, I forecasted my build pretty accurately, not gonna lie. Um, unfortunately, the Crusader, I didn't dive that much into. I knew Veiled was taking it over and I, I didn't think I'd actually play it. And then I saw him playing it, I saw others playing it. Obviously, I lost the stupid bet. Why would I, why, why did I change my class when I definitely did not need to do this? This is not, not what i wanted to do um but we did it we're here uh i think gear is going to make the difference i think i need to get the stupid air keeper that has to happen so that way i have a, the crit rate that way it gets me excited then i can get more excited and do like an, a better armor pin video which because i knew moving forward armor pin is going to get a little bit better uh, as we get more into the late game and i feel like if i have arrow keeper that i can showcase that a little bit more hand right because i can pop it get that uh that um basically the holy banner that moves with you and always had that crit damage popping um i think i also i need to get the shield now um i think paves uh, pavis of the 10 wings i think that's going to play with my play style more than anything mainly because it's a spinning shield and now it spirals around you and does not return um that works kind of like that reminds me a lot of like path of exile which is one of my one of my favorite games is because it acts like, as a constant like whirlwind right so you have to do damage constantly as you're moving in the open world for farming i i like that aspect i like that concept it's kind of fun um i have been playing around with some of these skills though i've been playing with uh let's see what am i rocking right now i know like shield charge this has been kind of fun uh, i have enjoyed this it's not like my knockback but it's a little different uh, i use it actually kind of as a movement ability it's kind of helped me in the uh the pvp aspect uh because i've been taking that in there just to catch up right so then i have a horse which obviously is a mo great movement skill this will never leave my bar uh shield charge is kind of nice to just dash get the, that extra little damage get that little extra burst which makes a big difference uh holy banner obviously i think that's a no-brainer honestly no different than a lot of classes you're always going to have two three that are like always a no-brainer i feel like holy banner is probably right there up there uh with it unless you have another satyr on your squad so that way you can go full damage i haven't quite gotten to that realm yet i'm gonna try to get in that realm especially i want to try to play it with a wizard i know our good friend matt capper went wizard i'm gonna try to do a collab with him 
Because I want to play with this, and I want to see if I can't do, um, like, the, uh, I, I can't remember what ability it is. It's Conjuration of Life. No, no, no. It's one of these abilities will actually allow me to beam with a legendary piece of gear, and then I can use the crystal of a wizard. I want to try that and just see how that really works well for me, if that suits my play style, because I think that could be fun. But uh, overall, it's been kind of lackluster. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Spinning Shield has been one major thing, but I know I'm going to love this one once i get that revolving skill and i gotta figure out what other legendaries i want if you got an idea leave comments down below i'm going to test everything if i'm going to be stuck playing the stupid crusader i'm going to test everything i'm going to go through every build i'm going to go through every possibility i'm going to document it all and i'm gonna be like okay this is what worked this is what didn't work here's what you need to know and what i would do and uh and then we'll go from there and then i'll finally get to switch um i will say though I tried punish punish felt really really good until i got the legendary piece of gear this uh um the burning heart here once i got that um sorry is that is that what it was called burning heart no 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 it's my weapon my weapon sorry my weapon legendary piece uh once i got the bristle sorry and that made my um sacred fire now also hurls wave of fire that made it feel a lot, lot better. Uh, that made me feel a little bit more ranged and more AOE. I like that ability. I think that was a great ability to have on a Crusader. Uh, it really made a big difference on my willingness, so to speak, of playing this class and really going for it. Um, I am, once again, I'm trying to amass the charms. Uh, obviously, you guys saw in one video, I got pretty good luck before. I've already gotten one with spinning shield on it. Um, I am just going to keep going ahead and rolling. I think I'm pretty close to actually getting another charm arm built out and once i get another charm built out i do want to make sure to focus on this i'm moving forward i'm always going to be saving the charms for a lot of these um classes if it's something that i know i'm going to play so uh, i'll definitely be saving the classes for a monk for later on but yeah i'm getting kind of close i think to uh to actually doing something with this okay so no I, i've got the one grand charm here so i'm not close at all i lied i thought i was i'm not now i can do one upgrade on another charm later on but i'm gonna keep playing it out i'm gonna keep seeing what i can get because i do feel like having those charms makes a little bit of difference in damage and once again i want to see what that does because technically that charm should not modify the banner so i want to do the test i want to see if it works if it doesn't work because hit chance by 100 percent that shouldn't actually get modified that much so we're gonna see what happens with it but if I'm correct, then it didn't do me any good and it was a waste of my time. But yeah, that's going to be it. This is a video. It's just an update of me switching my classes and uh, basically venting to you guys a little bit because I haven't been having that much fun with it. And I think it's because of the gear. I'm hoping it's because of the gear. I really don't want to be stuck with this. Also, there's one other thing that's pretty sad, depressing. I don't like it. We're rocking the treasure hunter. As part of the debate, I got two weeks stuck on the stupid treasure hunter. We're about a week into this stupid tree i've noticed a zero increase in drops i've noticed zero return for having this other than i've lost a lot of damage not only because i'm not a demon hunter but because now i'm crusader but because i lost all the general damage and in just natural right because of the um attributes i would pick i need three more to get this damage up but yeah it's it's pretty rough and yeah i, I can't wait till i can get rid of it now i'm sure for some people this is the godsend this is the god tier for you and you get everything you absolutely want with the crusader uh as far as gear goes especially for those who are constant grinders unfortunately i just don't fall in the category of where it is worth my time and actually while we're going to do this uh speaking of time because you know i i do have limited time oh here we go we got another legendary off the gambling definitely go see my video about gambling because uh here we go we just got another one right off the rip that took very very little effort and another one okay okay so you know what we complain about needing the gear for a video on on the crusader and we pop off and we get three and we got arrow keeper let's go okay um so maybe that just changed the the whole concept of this video maybe that just made the, the crusader better for me i don't know uh i'm not gonna bother buying these ones because well you don't can't drop greens one anyways but uh there's the gambling uh there's the three legos right off the rip let's go baby uh but yeah anyways that's gonna be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it uh let me know down in the comments below did you change your class and you regret it or are you happy with it let me know i'd be curious to hear your thoughts hope you guys have a good rest of your day peace